Hey guys, so this is my face routine. So foundation. <laughs> Why is this acting stupid? Foundation, highlight, contour, concealer, all that good stuff. So before I get into the video, I kind of want to show you. You know, since I'm just starting out, um, I'll show you some of the foundations that I have and that I've been using. And then, okay, so let's just go into it. So this one, I used this in the video. This is L'Oreal. L'Oreal Paris True Match in the color Cream Cafe. Cafe, cafe. Coffee, cafe. Coffee in the morning. Alright, next, I guess I should just pick them all up, right? Um, the next one that I want to show you, and I'm going in the order of how much I like them. So that's like my number one, like, go-to, you know. And these, the ones I'm showing you right now, these are the ones that I believe are like everyday make foundations that you can wear. Me personally, I don't wear makeup throughout the week just because I don't want to have to depend on it. Um, and if I do, it's just to cover up my red spots or something like that. Now this next one is from L'Oreal Paris as well. Um, Infallible Pro Matte Foundation. And it's in the color Classic Tan. Really like that one. So those two are like my two go-tos for just, you know, every day. However, this one, I hope you can see it. I don't know what my hand is doing. It's not working. Anyway, this is Revlon Color Stay in the color Caramel. And as you see, it's darker than my skin color um and that's because that's um that's how dark I get in the summer now oddly enough I got darker than that this past summer like my tan was on woo fleek so hopefully I get that tan again this summer but that's like the go-to one that I use for the summer because I get darker and then um I really like this one too it's not even a foundation, it's BB water. So if you, you know, and it's by Smashbox. So if you don't feel like, you know, putting on, you know, foundation or you don't want to feel like, like right now, after doing all my steps, my face feels light. I don't feel like I have a lot of caked on stuff. But yeah, and this is in the color medium dark. So I will try this out. Um... This one, I don't really have any complaints about this one. Um, it's Maybelline Fit Me. And it's the new look, Dewy Smooth. So, I had got this in hopes to try like a dewy look. Um, but then my friend who is like a, she's a professional anyway. Um, my friend Marissa, she told me how she like, you know, broke out from this really bad so i got scared and i was like okay you know what i'm already breaking out because of stress and everything else i don't need to do that so okay um now this now i know a lot of people love mac you know i see it in tutorials and all that stuff but mac and I don't know, I haven't explored MAC to the point where I know which one is which or all this other stuff. I just know that this one, okay, this is the Studio Fix Fluid. And, well, hey, it tells you do not use on damaged or broken skin. So what does that tell you? Anyway, this is not an everyday foundation. MAC is, no, MAC products, period. I have a few of MAC's products and I love them. For the stage. So if I was to, you know, if I was to be doing one of my plays, you know, or be on stage, yes, I would do my face up with this. This actually breaks me out. So I don't use it. But I can probably get like two uses out of it before my skin starts to fry. So 
that is definitely for the stage that is that is costume makeup that's not like everyday like you know foundation so i think that's all of them i really want to try the nars one so we'll see but anyway i've been talking too much um without further ado here is the video so let's get to it okay so i have my eyebrows arched already um now the first step that I'm going to do is I'm going to put on this Smashbox um, Photo Finish Primer. I'm going to take a small drop of that and I'm going to put that all over my face. Sorry, I'm like not feeling well. There's a lot going on. So just bear with me. I'm gonna go in with my LA Girl Concealers. I'm gonna go in with this one. And it's in the color Toffee. And I am just going to hit all of my red spots. I've been breaking out like really bad. And it's finally starting to like go down. But my red spots are still there. And then I'm going to take um, this one. It is the orange corrector. The, and I'm just taking that and doing it under my eyes like the dark circles. I'm going to blend it out with this because my beauty blenders are out of commission, but these work really great. I got these from Forever 21 for like $3.90, so not bad, and they, they blend well. Now I'm going to start with my foundation. I really like using this one. This is like, it's like an everyday foundation, True Match by L'Oreal Paris um, in the color Cream Cafe. And yeah, it's like an everyday, everyday, foundation so I'm gonna just take that and dot it like all over my face I'm gonna use this brush. I need to like invest in some decent brushes. No offense, Alta, but this is it brushes by Alta, and I'm just gonna buff it in my face.
Then I'm going in with that beauty blender. Not be this pad. Okay, now for the highlight, I'm going to take another, I don't know you're like, y'all, we keep using LA Girl. Yeah, because it's like $4 and it actually blends well into my skin. I know you all seen me use the naked one and I like it, but I have to do too much like to blend it in and I don't have time for it. So, and with this, you can use any foundation you want, any concealers that you want. I'm just showing you like how I do my face routine okay so taking this pro conceal I don't know if y'all can see it in the color oh crap in the color medium beige and I'm going to highlight under my eyes my nose and my chin I'm going to put setting powder under it and I'm going to use the I really want to try the Sasha Buttercup but right now I have the Laura Mercier translucent whatever translucent loose setting powder and I'm gonna take that and hit the spots that I just highlighted with the concealer. Now I am going to bronze up my face. On oh, the brush I used for the setting powder was this Morph. Is it Morph or is it Morphe? The M brush, Morphe brush in 438. And now I'm using their brush 527 to hit my spots okay and I'm using NARS duo bronzer and blush and the bronzer is in the color Laguna
Now I'm going to do blush. I'm going to use the blush in this palette. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. Um, orgasm. Hey, I didn't name it. They did. time for highlight I'm gonna use Urban Decay's Naked Illuminated Highlighter and this is in the color Aura Aura and I'm just highlighting right here right here right here right there mm -hmm. oh with this cute little Morphe brush five zero eight comment below and tell me what this is is it more or just more feet And this is the finished look. You just add a nice lip. Put on some mascara. And there you go. There you go.